Well, good morning to you on this fine Sunday. I wasn't gonna stream, but I did it anyway. <laughs> and this is not the goth household. <laughs> Could you imagine? I well, I I bulldozed the goth mansion, and now it's like this. No, <laughs> this is Andrea Long that um, got married to Benjamin Long. She was called something else from the beginning. She. Was... No. Så du rakar i varje dag. What is happening? Hybrid Flex har ett handtag man behåller på titaniumblad som är rakningen extra mjuk. Which decided it would, that it would start playing something. Um, no, I don't shave every day. Uh, that was weird. Anyway, where is my long household? There he is. Uh, so, okay. Andrea Hogan a townie, uh, fought with someone and she got sentenced to prison. But then she fall, fell in love with Benjamin that was running the prison at the time. So they run, ran away to each, with each other, not to each other. Um, and they have, <laughs> they live in this little tent and they have uh, created some kind of life for themselves uh i'm not sure what's going to happen with their crops but uh hopefully they won't die so but we're not playing them today i was just i just wanted to show you them they are living like a parallel little society over here with oh with their two children uh benjamin well he he got turned into a plant sim because he was tending to the plants a little bit too much so then he um, then he got himself a little plant baby <laughs> plant toddler plants in well he he produced offsprings from offspring from his spores <laughs> so little parsley was created and Angela was pregnant so she was like alrighty then and then they had little uh it's a boy named quest because i didn't know what to name the boy so i made me one of these hang on in my spreadsheet <laughs> uh, i made me one of these it counts how many letters start with how many living sims have a name that starts with each letter and we can see that m is very popular for some reason uh, so nobody was named q so now we have a little quest on our hands oops well that's not what i meant to do <laughs> i'm a professional streamer i promise so what I'm gonna do now? I have been um, each time to avoid like uh, corruption or something. Each time I exit a lot, I like. Do we have any of these? No. Well, I just re-randomize the this the randomize thingies see it fixed 28 objects of some kind i don't know what it is <laughs> it doesn't tell me but something was fixed like 28 issues i guess i don't know what it is it does but i i think it does something so it's gonna load into the neighborhood screen in a while And this also ensures that if I have babies, it, it should be no firstborn syndrome. We are going to, where are we? We are in the correct place. And we're going into the goth household. Now, <laughs> 
what has happened here is that Cassandra was, um, she wanted more and more babies and she was pregnant and then she um, suddenly died. I'm not entirely sure what happened. I'm just assuming she, she starved to death, but it, it was a bit weird. It might have been a ghost, not sure. So, um, well, she died. And Darren over here, he was at work at the time. So, uh, naturally, the, all the children was left alone at home. Uh, because Cornelius was also in school. Or at his work, I think. Um, so, like, yeah, the, all the children was left alone at home. So the social worker came and said, this is not okay. <laughs> and I assume she knew about it because the headmaster was visiting and he was not impressed. And he did not allow Cornelius into private school after that whole ordeal. Like the mother dying in front of him. No, not impressive. So... <laughs> um. All right, but Cornelius wants to win the Young Entrepreneurs Award, which means he wants to get promoted in his job, which means he needs a cleaning skill point. Uh, but he also needs to do his homework. Uh, and also he, uh, he, I transferred the uh, the deeds to the lots that Cassandra owned to him. I'm not sure he has the time to take care of those. So they might just like sort of be there. I don't know. Um, Darren wants a grandchild. Well, it might happen because in the last stream we were at Jerk's house and they did try for baby, but it didn't stay long enough to find out if that um, actually took, you know. <laughs> so, <laughs> we don't know. He might get a grandchild, I don't know. Does he have memories of getting grandchildren? Oh my goodness. He has the memories of having ch children taken away. Uh, but he met his new grandchild, Duke, the first time. And Dean. Yeah, I don't... He only has memories of ha having met new grandchildren. He doesn't have a memory of getting a new grandchild. Maybe that... Because I have the feeling that these doesn't fulfill. Um, yeah, I'm not sure, <laughs> I'm not sure. Oh, uh, there's a lot of people here. Oh, oh, we have Alexander as well. He graduated, did he graduate? I think he did. Yes, he graduated from college and uh, immediately got sent to prison because he, uh, he had been involved in fighting, but uh, he behaved and he got out and now he moved in here because I'm not sure Darren will stay here actually. Like he has no connection to this house now, but I don't know what to do with him. <laughs> so, so I mean, he's, he's just sort of here, like he can be here, but Alexander is like, uh, yeah, Cornelius is going to go to college at some point. Uh, I'm gonna help hold the estate. Um, yeah, something like that. He might even like be allowed to live here and start his family. We we'll see if there's a problem. I'm, I'm just gonna keep him here. Like, why not? <laughs> He wants to be best friend with Professor Melissa. 
I locked that in because th that would have helped him in school. So I think I'm gonna keep it locked in, but also he wants to be friends with Cornelius and I think that's a good idea. <laughs> It is very late. Maybe you should... Could you... No, he's going home already. Maybe we should ask everyone to leave. Because it's kind of weird that they're all here. <laughs> I don't know why they they are here. I keep talking to people out on the sidewalk and they invite themselves in. <laughs> oh, okay. Did that. Well, that's not leaving, is it? Alright. Oh. <laughs> she had to say goodbye to Cornelis. Alright. Okay. How was it? Cornelis is, I know, not straight. <laughs> I keep... He's bi. That's what it is. But Alexander, where is the... I have so many packed objects. Um, casual object. This this one. So show my token stats. He is very straight. Oh, oops, it's not what I meant to do at all. So I'm gonna start putting that into my spreadsheet so that I don't have to keep <laughs> checking. I'm fairly sure they're like straight, but you know, you never know. You need to check. Okay. Darren just wants to max out seven skills. Oh my goodness, he has a long way to go to do that. Well, you could start with mechanical skill because that will help you in at work oh my goodness thunderstorm wait you could you could uh, maybe send some emails to professors and stuff uh, and he wants to become friends with a lot of people I don't know why he's a family sim but I maybe he doesn't feel like he has enough friends. I don't know. He doesn't have a job either. Maybe he can tend to the lots that Cornelius will not have time to tend to them. Maybe that's what we do. Um, wants to be better friends with her. I have a self-imposed... Uh, isn't this Chandler? Can't be. He's already friend with Chandler. That's someone else. It, I have decided you can only do this to three sims because otherwise, like, the, the game... It's a hacked computer and you will be able to send to like everyone and it's quite effective so I don't think it's fair. <laughs> so I have a limit of three sims. You're allowed to email three sims at a time. I think they get like 10 extra points. When, whenever they do this. But I think, oh my goodness. Okay, that's gonna cause a fire. Um, I think he should call a cab and go to one of the lots. Take care of it. Uh, call taxi. And I'm gonna send him alone. I think. Could take Darren with him. Wait, does Darren have work 3 p.m.?
Yeah, now I'm gonna send Alexander alone. It's easier to keep track of because he doesn't have any times to meet. Uh, uh, no. Doesn't have any times to pass, as we say in Sweden. Nobody talks like that, by the way. People keep uh, doing this funny accent <laughs> for Swedish people when they speak English. And even Swedish people do it for fun. But nobody actually talks like that. Okay, so which one is... Oh, we need to go to the pool because it bugs me a lot that there is no hot tub in there. And we need to add a hot tub. Okay, Alexander is apparently on the toilet. Everybody has to go. Then you can also do homework. Do homework. Because he, he wants to go to college, so he wants to do his homework, see? <laughs> I'm gonna have him do all his homework. Hopefully he does it. Before school. We have one day left of school and then there's the weekend. Sometimes, like in The Sims 1, I recently played it. Uh, Sims 1 doesn't have weekdays. <laughs> you keep forgetting that. But, so in The Sims 2, I sometimes get annoyed that there's a weekend. <laughs> like, because it, it, it disrupts my uh, um, getting their grades up and everything. <laughs> but they do have extra time to do their homework. But sometimes I, I'm go, I am like, well, they've done their homework. Now what do we do? Where do we put a hot tub? Because it is outrageous that we don't have one. I do feel like we could build uh, a little extra platform here just get rid of all that stuff and also this one what is oh. like a saw and then remove this fencing stuff and we're gonna have a, a platform what do you mean can't level terrain try harder <laughs> What do you mean? Why? Is it because the chairs are there and I can just move them, build and then move them back? Because sometimes the game is stupid like that. It is. Yes, that is very silly. Because now I can move them back. See? We can still have them there. And I'm gonna have the. Actually, do we want railing there? Maybe we don't. Maybe we. Or maybe we do. Maybe we just do like that and then have. What's wrong now? Oh. See, you can't you can't build railing while you have the <laughs> little um, lamp there. It's silly like that. So you have to move them first, but then you can move them back. It's very silly, but it's the little quirks that makes the game fantastic, I guess. <laughs> now we can put a hot tub here because we really, really need to have one. Oh, we don't have much money. Do we put it this way? I think so, because then you can like look out over the pool area. See, now we have a woohoo spot that is way better. Like earlier, I have had my Sims woohoo on these benches. It's not very nice. Now they can woohoo over here. It's way better. Save. And I kept getting um, surprised that there wasn't a hot tub because I, I expect there to be. 
There we go. Now, how do we make money on this lot? Do we have one of those um, pay to be here stuff? Or do we just sell snacks? Maybe we just sell snacks. That, that won't render much money. Well, maybe I put one of those out, but I don't want it for my other sim, so I'll, uh, maybe I'll remove it. <laughs> uh, where do I get it? Where is it? There. I mean, it, it is a nice lot. They should pay to be here. Maybe I put it... Um, I want to put it there. Why can't I? What other object? Oh. It's a door. Okay. If I put it here, will it cause issue? I don't know. Let's just put it there. And then start charging customers. Do I need to set price first? I don't know. I do not know. Also. We're selling nothing. That's what we are selling. <laughs> we have a little share here. Okay. Okay. That's fine. All right. Um, I think like we could be nice and not charge. We were going to charge nothing. So I can charge like just a little bit. <laughs> Do we have employees for this lot though? I don't think we should have because it will be uh, too expensive. Oh, oh. Does Alexander have a phone? Does he have a cell phone? No, he does not. Mm, he does have one of these. Oh, he has a diploma. Very nice. Uh, and he should have put his loan jar out, and he did not. I'm not sure. I don't think he owes every anything, though. We can check. I think he might be... No, he doesn't have a loan, so it's fine. Um, the loan jar works like if you have it out, uh, the loan will slowly increase. It doesn't do anything else. <laughs> you can repay it. It keeps track of your loan. That's all it does. Uh, so you have to impose the the punishment for not paying yourself. And what I do is, if someone has a loan, they have to pay that first before paying any bills. So that way, they can get punished by the game by the repo man for not paying their bills because they have a loan. So that's uh, the thing, but uh, I wanted, where is it? Oh, we, we don't have money enough. We need like two and a half thousand simoleons to be able to buy a cell phone on my lot. Alrighty then. Maybe you can't buy it from yourself. I don't know. <laughs> well, maybe we can earn wait is it open now how does it work maybe i need one of those open signs not sure why do you have that it might be in decorations i think yes we can put that there. And so now we know that it is open indeed. Right. And we can try and sell to these unsuspecting customers. <laughs> if we have time, because I put it ridiculously cheap, so they are very inclined to start paying. And this system is kind of overpowered because money will just sort of pour in oh we need to help him uh may i help you 
We only have one refrigerator. You you need to go check that. <laughs> Alright, he seemed to like us. Wait, I don't need to have a cell phone, I can just buy a phone. <laughs> Hello there, Alexander. You have been you have a lot in common with my friend Priya Ramashwami. Mind if I give Priya your number? I think you two would get along as well as you and I do. Alright. Did I get it? Uh wait. Did I click the wrong button? I don't know. Where did she go? Usually I have one of the blue ones. Oh, I don't know what happened. Maybe I messed that up. Uh, it doesn't matter. But I'm gonna put a phone. Where? Yeah, it's nice to have a share, but you can sit elsewhere. <laughs> So now we can call Sim, so we can try and fulfill this. Oh, he wants to have a date with someone. All right. Uh, he wants to be best friends with prof the professor. Can I just talk to her? Wait, I think it's like you need to invite her over in order to be best friends because you can't really increase the long-term relationship. Oh, there's a witch too. All right, I'm not gonna talk to her. <laughs> over the phone, you can't. You you only increase the short term over the phone. But he also wants to be friends with. I don't know. If, can we call Cornelius? He, I mean, he's not here. So maybe we could call him. Um, if I can find him. Yes, I can call him. Fantastic. And we can just talk to him a little bit. Oh, they're not having a very good relationship. Uh, hug friendly. Hey, hurry up. You can't let her leave, actually. Maybe we could... no. I can't let her in for free. Or can I? Uh, grant free entry to Professor Melissa. Yes. She shouldn't have to pay. I invited her. <laughs> well... Didn't I do it? Didn't I... No? Well, I don't know. Okay, well... Yeah. I don't know what's going on. Hugger. That's gonna be fine. Okay. Good. And can we flirt with her? I don't know. She, he has two bolts with her. I'm not sure. Wait, we could. Do we have a. Uh, where's the adjust? Thingy there. We don't have an adjuster. Now we do. I don't think it should be over there. You just replace that fig tree with this one. And uh, he, Alexander has the hots for Tiffany Tellerman. Who is Tiffany? Well, if that's what who you want to be with. Then, oh my goodness, ring up these customers. Then I should call her, shouldn't I? Tiffany Tellerman. <laughs> okay. Well, the heart wants what it wants.
There, got the simoleons. He was not good at that. <laughs> do we know Sylvie? Yes, we do. We don't like her. Okay, uh, call Sim. Maybe, maybe we uh, ask Tiffany person on a date. Wait, maybe I should call her up for a date instead. Mm, I don't know. Let's talk to her first. Where is, where is the T section? Tiffany Tellerman. Just talk. All right. <coughs> See, he is in love with Lucy, but you know that's so complicated. <laughs> So, if, if ACR tells me he has the hots for Tiffany, then Tiffany it is. So we could... Can I, like, ask on a date? But we also need to... charge the customers. So it will be a strange date, but it, yeah, I don't know. Uh, Tiffany. Sounds great. I will be there in a few. Fantastic. I should save. Um, where did she go? <laughs> Is she here yet? That's a very strange place to save. Okay. Maybe she will come to us. I don't have the energy to walk all over there. Yes, she is here. Uh, he wants to slow dance with her. He also, also wants to eat. Maybe we should add a restaurant to this lot. I keep like adding everything to every lot, but you know, loading screens are not that fun. <laughs> so, <clears throat> well, it, it's okay to have a little restaurant next to the pool. There's usually a restaurant next to a pool. Yeah, okay, uh, charge her for everything and then like flirt with this. Lovely person. Slow dance. We want to talk to her. Talk to her. Talk, talk, talk. Uh, that. She's like, uh, you invited me on a date. Why aren't you talking to me? <laughs> Congratulations, your business is now rank one and you have gained a point. That's nice. What should we have? We can have... Um, a notable reputation. You'll enjoy a starting boost to all of your new relationship. Relationships. Well, mm, assess mood, no. We could just take money. I don't think this will benefit this business so much, uh, getting a discount on restocking. Um, Influential, while well, most people need a boatload of friends <clears throat> to be really influential, you just need to be yourself. With this perk, your capacity for influence will take a nice swing upward. Um, I think I'm gonna just go with money, but that reminds me too. Does he have money in the bank? I keep forgetting people having that. He does. He has 22,000, but he, he wouldn't want to use that for this lot because um, <clears throat> it's not his lot. He's just mining it <laughs> for Cornelius. So I don't think he would use his own money uh, to invest in anything. But now we have enough money for that thing I wanted. This one. Because... Uh, I like my sims to have mobile phones and <coughs> sometimes I'm on a lot and I 
wish there was one of these. So, do I put that like this? Can I buy from this now? No. Okay, so if I do this, hmm, because we own this lot, I'm not allowed to buy from it. All right, okay. Well, <laughs> maybe everyone else buys uh, mobile phones if I have that there. That would be handy. Alright, um, as long as no nobody wants to buy something, we can just carry on with the date. Not much people here, is there? Okay, oh, so the business is really slow. <laughs> and also, money-wise, it's awful. But that's just, it's an investment. Hey. Oh, that didn't go well. Uh, stop that. And, and tell her a joke instead. Oops. Entertain joke. And he also wants to play with her. So tickle her, that is always successful, I feel. That's what we do. <laughs> oh now Alexander wants to get married to Lucy but Lucy just married Randy oh well if that's what you want to do Alexander I think you should end this date or maybe just um gather some uh, points from it uh, some aspiration points so that you're all happy and stuff uh, you, he wants to dance with her so why not uh, how do I dance with her come on uh, it should be here somewhere I'm just blind or oh, maybe we don't have a good enough relationship yet slow dance so we could just appreciate her She's very pretty. Oh, well, sometimes that's not enough. Oh, time is running out. This is not best <clears throat> the best date in the world. But she's a very good customer. <laughs> Oh, she doesn't even have a star yet. Okay. Well, someone is paying us. All right. Okay. Hello, person. Oh, he wants to flirt with Lucy. We need to end this date. This, this does not. Uh, do we end the date? And we need to help this customer. <laughs> what are you doing, Alexander? <laughs> well, it's a pretty nice date. <laughs> and they fell in love with her. Alright, they ha now have a crush on each other. But he wants to marry Lucy, so... You want to invite her, so I'm gonna invite household and see what we can destroy <laughs> she just got married she like ran away with randy to live in his crummy apartment and uh she didn't even take her child with her because there was nowhere to put the child so yeah but we invite over household. This is gonna end well. <laughs> I can't stop myself. Their marriages are not like long. What is his lifetime wish? He wants six grandchildren? Oh, then you can't be screwing around with old people. You need to like procreate or whatever. <laughs> Sounds great. We will be right over. Yeah, Randy is gonna have a good day. Hello, Lucy. Oh, did you bring Randy? Yes, she did. All right. 
it's curious though that she comes here and he he comes from the other other direction like what was going on before <laughs> i don't know uh greet her with a kiss kiss darling i don't know <laughs> i never used those but i thought maybe i do this time oh these walls they are annoying aren't they oh Free entry to Lucy. Ludi. Hello. Yeah, she is hot. He still wants to invite her over. She's already here. Um, but okay. Well, uh, flirt with her. Uh, do a caress. I don't know what is what. What is their relationship like? I can't figure it out. I can't remember her. Oh. Yep. <laughs> that will do it. Ruining marriages. <laughs> That's what we do. That's what Alexander wants to do. Like she got away from him, he feels. She wants he wants to give him her. Oh my goodness, I can't speak. Alexander wants to give Lucy a back rub. English 101. Oh, now Randy is all upset. I think, like, if we we will just um, convince Lucy to move in with us, I feel. He wants to hire Lucy as an employee? <laughs> Alright. Uh, can I do... How do I do that? Uh... Sims can hire someone as an employee on the phone or computer or in person to hire with a blah 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 blah. Uh, hire Sims in person by clicking on the Sim you wish to hire and select hire interaction. Oh, I can just hire her. Oh, oh, that was easy. <laughs> the Sims 4 could never have it this easy. I thought it would be a complicated process. <laughs> um. Wage 20, all right, yeah, that's fine. Do you want to work for me? She probably, did she? No, she didn't have a job. This is awesome because she didn't have a job. So now she does. Congratulations, Lucy will start work immediately. Be sure to sign a new employee a job. Yes, well, but I also want to marry you, so I'm gonna make up with you. <laughs> See how upset Randy gets. <laughs> I'm just gonna steal Lucy from under your nose. Is that okay? Um, maybe I ask her on a date because that will help. I feel because then I can see what she wants. She's all married and stuff. On this, on this hand, she's married. <laughs> There we go. What what is she up to? She wants to fall in love with Ricky. Well, but she also wants to play with Alexander and dance with Alexander. So can we dance? We can slow dance with her. That's a good idea. Yes, I am good boss. I dance with my employees. <laughs> oh, Tiffany was still here and she's not happy about this. Well, I mean, okay, well, sorry. You, you go away. We didn't promise each other anything. Stop it. Now, where was I? I was talking to Lucy. Chat with her. What do you want? Oh, she wants to say goodbye. Well, uh, goodbye. Maybe I should say goodbye to Tiffany. She could become a nuisance. Oh, well, Lucy wants to woohoo in a hot tub. That could be arranged. I need to save. This is way too good to lose progress on. <laughs> uh, 
I'm so glad I played today. Uh, get in. All right, so he wants to have six grandchildren. So he would not just woohoo her. He would try for baby. But I think we need to make her selectable to be able to do that. But that is fine. Yeah, okay, stop talking now. You're boring. I want to see if I can try for baby uh, without making her selectable, but I think I need to do that first. So let's ask her to join us in the hot tub. See, I told you we need... <laughs> We need a hot tub at the pool. It's weird not to have it. This is nice. Okay, uh, start with a little cuddle. Gosh. Okay, yeah, we can only woohoo, but I can fix that, I think. Otherwise, we'll do a casual woohoo. Do I have a summoning bush? 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 Do we have a summoning bush? Uh, there's a bush over there, but I don't think it's one of those. No, just a row of bushes. Well, where do we have it? We have this one. It says it's for apartments, but it seems to work otherwise too. Um, so I, hmm. where do we, I'm gonna put that there, do, will I remember I put that there? I, maybe, <laughs> because this kind of bush tells me it's a teleporter bush, but we can also make selectable, uh, Lucy London, hello Lucy, can I know, no, we cannot, um, try for baby with her now. But we can do a, a casual woohoo. What is this? Will I woohoo? You could probably talk me into that. Total score 100. Attack and score. Well, I think she would. So, because. Hmm. Maybe I make up uh, with her first. Because I usually think that if. This one, this number here is more than 95, then they would woohoo. And it was only 93, but now, <laughs> now it's uh, 97. So, then it's okay. Sometimes also I do, like if they have made out. Oh, she said no. <laughs> I did not think she would say no. But you want to woohoo in the hot tub. Come on. Why Why are you not wanting to do that? Well, okay. Maybe I splash her for it. Alexander has al always been a bit abusive to the Lucy. He was doing the, the head rubbing thing a lot when they were teenagers and like were going out. So I didn't like that, so I didn't like pursue that relationship. But of course he still wants her. Did you splash her? How's business doing? I don't... oh. <laughs> well, I, I'm sorry, I need to go ring up these customers. I'll, I'll be right back. Also, I think she needs a break <laughs> because her her little ball on top of her head is yellow. There. And you can rejoin her after. That was quite a lot. What did you buy? <sighs> oh, now he's all sad. She said no to woohoo. Oh well, you need to woo her a little bit better. <clears throat> Maybe we actually do the things that he has the wish to do because that, that will 
usually, oh, and I'm gonna unclick this, be friends with Cornelius business. Maybe he doesn't care about that. Oh, I'm, not, I'm gonna keep it. <laughs> I changed my mind. I take it back. Oh, since I made her clickable, I, I can do that. Get out, I wanna tell you a joke, it's very important. Uh, joke. Maybe the date needs to be better before she will woohoo. Apparently the score 100, what, what was it? Like, casual, will I woohoo? Sure, I'm game, where's the bet? Now she's way more into it. I don't know. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> now he wants to woohoo with her. Yeah. I want you to do that too. Um, you know, maybe play with her first. And then get in. Let's try this again. They both want it, so... Let's see if she will uh, make up first. Move here. And then cuddle. We do have the option to woohoo. But do make out first. <clears throat> Why did you stop? I didn't tell you to stop. He's being elu elusive. No, she's just being Lucy. <laughs> I guess. I don't know. Try and make out. Can we do it? Time is running out. Hurry up then. There we go. So after this, casual woohoo. There we go. <laughs> they did it, and we got a oh, not not that. We gotta ring up these customers. Fantastic. <laughs> well, uh, Alexander is sure enjoying himself. Question is though, can I, like, oh, did I actually? Oh, now she's all over Alexander. I'm gonna lock that in. <laughs> and I'm gonna make her unselectable because we... Uh... No, isn't she a visitor? Make unselectable Lucy. Stop this quickly. And go ring up the customers. It's very important that you actually take care of the business. I don't feel like Alexander is that like invested in this business it feels like uh he uh, his mind is elsewhere <laughs> but then also call her over i don't think i don't know if we could ask her to move in while we're on this lot or if we have to go home and invite her there and ask her to move in i don't know we'll see Wait, are they in sync? Um, maybe they are. Where is Luke? Yes, they... I think they are. Because technically it's Friday night, but Alexander will not age up until... And until he is at home. What is it? Oh, you're hungry? And yet, I don't care. <laughs> Would she 
Come over here. Maybe I need to go over to her. Oh, this, oh, we need some employee to, to refill this. I don't know, because I don't have time. Hey, are you coming? Apparently not. Ask Lucy home. How do I do that? It, I think it's ask back to my place. Will you get out of the tub? I feel this is a bug. I'm gonna make her selectable to get her out of the tub. I don't think this is right. Yeah, get out of the tub. There. Make unselectable Lucy London. Back and forth, back and forth. Oh, she's really unhappy now. Maybe we should just uh, go home. I don't know. Can I... Um, can we, like, propose to move in together? Is there a propose option? Um, doesn't seem to be. Or I'm blind again. Who knows? Don't get in. Stop. Just flirt with her. We could also... Um, can't I tell her to take a break? I don't know. Oh, we, can, we could tell her to restock. <laughs> Management. Uh, where is it? At home for it. Assign. Uh, restock items. That's what we want her to do. <laughs> Can you restock my items, please? How's that dirty? I don't know. Can I also like? I want her to take a break. Take a break. There you go. Yeah, I, I think the date is going to end and then we're going to go home. I'm gonna close the shop. Sorry, Elise Volosenko. Uh, you will have to come back another day. Thanks, that was really fun. Let's do it again soon. Yeah. I will. I'm just gonna check if there's a proposed to move in right now. I don't ex expect there to be. No. So I'm gonna have him go home. Where's all taxi? Do I have to go all over there? Can I use this phone? I can call taxi here. <laughs> there we go. Where do you want to go? I want to go home. But now, when he he gets home, they will not be synced anymore. So well, that's fine. <laughs> <clears throat> we will deal with that later. All right, that's smart, Alexander. Delfimos. Yeah. We're going home. <laughs> Let's just leave the hot dogs on the uh, grill until next time we get here. I'm sure they're not gonna burn or anything. It's gonna be fine. I really like 
these loading screens way better than The Sims 4. See how you know that they're gonna go all the way there and then back and then it's over. So you, it's like a, a progress bar, so you know roughly how far you've gotten. Uh, in The Sims 4 it's like it could take an hour, it could take two seconds, we don't know. <laughs> See, he, oh my goodness, he was away for 17 hours. Well, um, that's, that's just how it is. All right, and Darren wants to play the piano. Let's just speed through all these things. Bank deposits. Yeah, okay, that's good. They have quite a lot of money in the bank, so they get quite... Oh my goodness, we have no money. Well, maybe who will take out money? Maybe everyone does. Can I access his... I can. Where did I say? I think I put Alexander in here. So I'm going to make him have, I'm going to that over there. Maybe we, I can't, I can't extract money from his bank account right now. So I'm going to borrow a thousand simoleons and I'm going to say that every day, everyone that lives here, um, pays like, a thousand simoleons from their bank account to uh, to the household fund funds because that's just what I do or like every time I need money <laughs> maybe <laughs> I don't know bank online withdraw a thousand do I get the number that is left when I do this or do I need to check it manually yes I get the number handy Darren now has 23200 and Cornelius will do his homework first Fine. We need money in the household funds in case some uh, our staff needs payment. Mm. There's not gonna be babies here for a little while, so I'm just gonna sell all the baby stuff. Maybe we don't have that much baby stuff. But, you know. There's a loan jar over here too. Alright. I think it's right to put the interest at 5%. I'm not sure. Oh, I'm gonna have it like that. It's fine. Can I direct him to withdraw money? If this happens, then it will remind me to pay the loan back. I don't know. What are you doing now? You wanted to play the piano. Why don't you go play the piano? Uh, practice. School bus will be here at any moment. I don't know how much of this homework we will be able to do by then, but we will try. Oh, now he's <laughs> sad. Okay. He's not in the mood. All right, that's fine. You can just play some games. Uh, play video game. And now he has 189 because he got all the money from Alex from Cassandra. 
I don't know if that was right. Should he have gotten all that? Because she has four children. Maybe, maybe she should have like given some of the money to these kids. I think she had 180. I'm not sure. I can check the history of my Google spreadsheet. Loading versions. Why does this take so long? <laughs> Page is unresponsive. Um, can I reload it? What is happening? Well, I think I broke Google or something. Sorry about that. <laughs> if someone was using it. Um, well, maybe I just uh, figure that stuff out later. Then. Maybe. Man, what day did she die? It's kind of working now. Um. Hey, the goth household disappeared. Oh, it was the dreamer household. Um, no, wait, yes. I need to go back even further. Naturally, I had it as a dreamer household because her, uh, Cassandra's last na name was Dreamer, but now it's back to the goth household. But well, now it's goth again. Okay, well. She had like around 180,000 simoleons. Like, uh, it's not exact because I can't find the exact date. So, what if he does, what if we go, like he gets half of that and then Davis get half of what is left and then Delmar gets, now these are twins, aren't they? Yeah, okay, well, so. I'm gonna do a, a little calculation over here. <laughs> so, he got 180,000 and, oops, he should give, you should only have gotten half of that, I decided. And then we have 9,000 left for the, the twins. To get, so they get to share. Is this fair? I don't know. <laughs> um. I don't know. Do they share? Wait, did I accidentally? Yes, I keep missing a zero. Do they get to share this? Oh. So they get 22,500 each, and then Seth gets whatever is left. It should be a half 
It should be four to five thousand, I think. I don't know. And it is. I don't think he should get that much. Then he gets more than these two. So maybe they don't, they get this. Now wait, how do I, how do I divide this? <laughs> <laughs> well, okay, so maybe Sif gets like a fourth of this. Okay, I'm gonna have to twins. Cornelis, twins, Sif. Okay, so the twins gets share the rest wait <laughs> I'm so bad at this there now the twins get more than Seth okay but I'm not I'm gonna okay so this means, in order to accomplish this, I'm gonna, do I, can I do this? I think I can send the money. So transmit bank accounts. And we should get like, Maybe I just give them 30,000 because it's easier. <laughs> okay. I'm not sure this is doing it right. Okay, you can play later. I, I need to fix this first. He has forgotten all about his brothers. This is me. Okay. We can't do this. What we can do is extract the money and just do family funds stuff. That we can do. So, do that. We do bank online and just withdraw. Um, 90,000. Oh, that's convenient. Yeah, and then go to school. <laughs> so now he has 99,800 on his bank account. There. And we can save. Wait. Yeah, maybe Darren can fix this. He can... Because now the money is in the household funds, we can do bank online, transmit money to household funds. Think playable, and we should actually get rid of all the ninety thousand. No, we shouldn't because Davis was adopted. Oh my goodness! I think it's easier to just go into the neighborhood. <laughs> just. <laughs> Do the money sheets. I think that that will um that that will solve everything. I think. And I just had written down twins, and that's not 
that good because I can't really remember who is the twins. So we refer to our family tree over here. We have Dalmar and Davis and Seth. So Dalmar and Davis are the twins. Yes. Okay. Well, that makes sense since Seth is the non non twin. <laughs> oh well, it, it, I'm confusing. So, let's just first. Here's the Goth house. Can I see how much money they have? Not sure I can. Well, so we go into sheet and we go to family funds. If I can spell that right, family funds golf minus ninety thousand. Is that the right amount of zeros? I think so. There. So now if we open them again, hopefully the money was extracted from there. So now they're like in cyberspace. <laughs> So what we need to do is find the orphanage because over here we have Dalmar uh, and Seth. So first, as said, Dalmar is going to get 33,750. Okay. And the name of this household is orphanage. So open this sheet box again and we're gonna do plus this time and it's gonna be orphanage and it's gonna be plus 33750 33750 like so so this number should increase next time I open it it did fantastic and we also need to do the Ceph 22,500. Somehow we, we, I get a... <laughs> now it's 70,000, okay. I'm gonna do this again. But do 22,500. What was that? Was that the right number? Yes. 22,500. I know this text is like crazily small but this is what we'll do so and but before i forget i'm gonna go in here and see if i can put it on their bank accounts i think i can apparently you forget your siblings when they get taken away by the social worker that doesn't make any sense really but that is apparently what happened so where is Shelby? She is asleep. You cannot be asleep right now. Oh, we need to wait for this stupid computer to be repaired. Okay. Well, that is just fantastic. We could buy a new computer, but I did hire this lady here. Hey Shelby, is Marshall available to talk? <clears throat> Marshall? Yes. Do we have a Marshall in here too? Oh, yeah, because the Burb children was also taken away. <sighs> it's a little bit chaotic and these beds do not really look like double beds, but I'm going to allow it. I'm gonna look another way. <laughs> and she's hungry. Well, serve lunch then. Are you done? Can I use it now? Fantastic. Okay, bank online. So we are because wait, can we This is not locked yet. Yes, no, okay, good. So uh we can do it is this the right boy? Delmar? Yes, Delmar was going to get uh thirty-three seven fifty. So Wait, wait, can't he bank online? Yes, 
deposit. So 30,000 and then more of them. <laughs> deposit. I wish we could just like enter a number, but that's not how it works. We need to do 33. Uh, bank online, deposit. Um, 500. Deposit. I wish we had a something ending with a 50. I think we do when we have less money, but we don't right now. Wait, what did I do? Okay, so maybe the 50 get lost in mail or something. <laughs> um, it was a transfer fee there. So please go do that now. This takes precious time away from my Friday, where I can uh, try and adopt children. Mary Sue already adopted a boy. Uh, well, she took him in. We'll see if she adopts him later, but I don't think he will. He will just keep him as a foster child, I think. Because I don't like messing up the... See, if you actually adopt them, then they go away from the family tree, and I don't like that. <laughs> so. Well, he had nothing on his bank account from the start, so that is very good, because then... What, what is happening? I'm not saying I'm crazy about everything at school, but my guidance counselor says she's going to send a letter to my boss at work if I keep cutting out on school days. Oh, well, okay. Deal with that later. So Delmar now has 33,700 on his bank account, and I'm going to say that is good enough. Where is he? Delmar, there you are. There. So, and Seth also needs the monies. You need to leave the computer now. Go there. And deposit. Oh, I hate, I can't, I can't pause while I'm in a menu. 20,000. 20, Bank online. No, not transmit. Deposit. 2,000 and then deposit 500. I think that's right. Stop taking care of your needs. <laughs> I'm having different plans for you. Because I never remember to do this unless I do it like straight away. There we go. So now he has 22,500 on his bank account. That's fantastic. There. So now that that's done, we can just go into neighborhood again. Oh my goodness. <clears throat> but we do have little Davis left to fix. He is over uh, here, I think. Yes. Davis Dreamer. I named this household apparently Oldie Dreamer. <laughs> Family funds plus what we did. What, what, what was it? 33. 750. Oldie Dreamer. I wrote that wrong. You should have the number in the end. There we go. 55. 
Yes. Okay. We can go in and put this in his bank account and then we will be d done with the inheritance because I don't feel it's uh, fair that Cornelius get to inherit the house and gets all the money. But I think you get like diminishing um, monies. For being born later. <laughs> That's just the rules that I made up. Um, I can't help it. So, bank online. I'm so tired of this now. <laughs> Donate money. 30,000. Bank online. No, did I donate? I, I'm not. We're not donating it. Bank online. Deposit. 30,000. Bank online. Deposit. 3,000. Bank online, deposit, 500, bank online, deposit, 200. That should be it. What, what happened? What was that? Like, he is not good grades. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I know. Did he? But he has, I don't think he has homework because they just moved in. So... Yeah, gonna be fine. Also, he will grow up in two days and it's Saturday morning for him. There we go. He has now 33,700 in his bank account, which is what we needed to accomplish. Fantastic. Where is he then? <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Davis, where are you? There you are. Where's your bank account? There he is. 33,700. Fantastic. All right. So now... I feel better. <laughs> Because if you're if you're uh, of old money, then you should have some when your mother dies. Okay, back to the goth household. Uh, well, I I exited the goth household, so now we don't have this little handy um, sign that tells us when Alexander gets back. But we know it was like Friday night or something like that. So. It's fine. Oh, he wants Dean to get an A plus report card. Well, how would you know? <laughs> it's not in this house. What what will I do? Get Seth into private school? Well, I'm sad to tell you this, but you have no control over this. But you could like. He seems to be thinking about family, so we could invite... Wait, when does he go to work? Oh, no, until this afternoon. He can invite Jerk over. What is the point of him playing the piano when he has already maxed out the creativity skill? I don't know. So where's Dirk? Dirk Dreamer, invite over household. Get to know everyone a little bit better. Oh, we have bills, do we? Everyone. That sounds great. We will be right over. We don't have any bills. That's good. I greet everyone somehow. Come on. Maybe they will come in and ring the doorbell? No? Greet everyone. I wonder if Melinda likes being back here. Yeah. 
Hello. Steph is pregnant. <laughs> All right. Okay. That's good to know. Steffi. All pregnant. So I'm just gonna... Like, I, I am sure she is pregnant. Well, I'm gonna... She is wondering if she's pregnant, but like... Really? When they do that, they are pregnant, let's be honest. So she came over to uh, destroy our toilet, I guess. That's the picture we take to indicate that we think that one of our sims are, is pregnant. If they're having a good time, can I join? <laughs> Let's see what happens. Maybe, do they have room? One, two, three, four, five, six, and with the new baby seven. So they have room for Darren to, to move in with them. So maybe it's still Friday morning. Maybe he does. Maybe he moves in with them. But they're one day ahead of, of the goth house, so he needs to wait. He needs to wait a moment. But, <laughs> but we can have him move in with them. That would make more sense. Like, he really likes them and he wants grandchildren and everything. So maybe he moves in to help them. And they are having money trouble. It makes so much sense. Yes, he will uh, He will live here for one more day, year, whatever you want to call it. And then he will move in with them. Yes. That's what he will do. What's this? Steven, Thing T Steven Tinker. Ooh, Doug Mars. Apparently very hot, so we'll greet her. Well, uh, Darren, if you're planning to move in with your son, you can't actually uh, have a wife or anything, but you can date. It's fine. <laughs> Oh, hello. Oh, he doesn't even know her. That's unfortunate. <laughs> she is your daughter-in-law. You should like, know her better, but she didn't feel well, so she had to go home. Okay. I'm just gonna kind of see what they do now. Because he only has wishes that I can't really fulfill right now. So, yeah. <laughs> Oh, no, now we have many. Fantastic. And I know I said earlier that you're not allowed to pay bills while you have a loan, but that loan that Alexander has really is to the household. because So I'm gonna allow it. There we go. Oh, he's gonna tell Melinda a joke if she doesn't run away too far. <laughs> Good luck, Darren. Good luck uh, keeping up with them. Can we like try and do that? Come on. 
Oh, here's. What is happening? Same rap. All right. Okay. Well, Greek Randy, I guess. Okay. Let's have a party every day. Do we have a gardener coming over, or is the butler supposed to do that? I don't know because this is not well kept. These flowers are dead. I don't like it. I'm gonna call and have. If we don't have a gardening service, we should have one. We need to keep this house. You know, well kept. Uh, garden club. No. I think we already have a gardener. All right. Well, they're not doing their job, are they? Maybe I need to fix that then. Carpool. Oh my god. If I don't keep up with my homework assignments, blah blah. Yes, I know. I tried <laughs> earlier. Maybe you could have some fun with one of your... What are they? Are they like cousins? No, half. No, oh, wait. <laughs> I keep getting mixed up. Wait. So. They're not related at all. <laughs> That's why. <laughs> I think. I, it's, it's kind of confusing. This family tree is kind of confusing. These are half brother and sisters, but these are not the ones that are over here. Wait, where is where is Dirk? There's Dirk. So these ones in relation to Yeah, they they're like let's just say extended family because by blood, they're not related at all. But if they were, they would be like uncles or something. I don't know. He does want to go to college. He needs to step up his game if, <laughs> if he's going to do all this. But his fun meter is so low so he could play where is it play ssx oh no he's so sad don't worry Cornelius. it will work out like you have money in the bank and you have you own community lots and like everything it's it's gonna work out did you stop with the gardening? I didn't tell you to stop. Seriously. The gardening service has... Either they didn't come or... Oh, <laughs> the butler is trying to keep up. Well, good luck. Oh, it's time for work too. All right. Well, he has quite some time to, to get his grades up and everything, uh, but it, I don't think teenagers are taken away if they get an F. I, th I think they just, you know, I think that's fine. All right, now nobody's here. <laughs> I don't have a sim to play. What are you doing, butler? Well, no wonder you don't get anything done. Okay, well, I can move this headstone over then, I guess. They're so weird. I don't know what the front side is of these headstones. It's strange. At least we got the butler to go do something else. Oh, he's stuck over there too.
everyone is about to age up now. <laughs> okay, uh, age. We have Darren is 59, coming up on 60. Alexander is 27 and Cornelius is now, oh, not 25, 15. Don't get fired. <laughs> he didn't get fired. Fantastic. Um, have a bob. Have a bubble bob if you think that's fun. I hope you, I hope they think that's fun to do. And then he can do homework. He has the opportunity to enter college. Yes, I know, but he's not allowed yet. I mean, technically, uh, by the game's rules, you are allowed to enter college as soon as they turn teenagers. But then you don't get to play them as teenagers. So, I have rules. <laughs> I think it's okay for Darren to move out now and we can pretend he is um you know because now he's in sync with um with the ages so because i think his needs are gonna get reset i think that's fine okay uh find own place where is it there's no find own place? Where is it? Find a job, right? With... Am I blind again? Is he not allowed to move right now? I don't know. We could move him the ugly way. <laughs> By uh, loading up the other lot. Do we have a newspaper? Somewhere? Did someone steal it? We could just move, uh, load up the other lot and like spawn him over, but I don't like it. I want him to. Maybe we need to wait for Alexander to get home. I don't know why though. There should be a find own place option, but I can't find it. Alright, well. That's too bad. Oh, he's not at home, that's why. <laughs> well, he'll be home at 9 p.m. That's pretty soon. Well, now we're out of fun again. Play. We should get him a computer in his own room. Or maybe he should take this room. Yeah, he will probably do that once Darren moves, moves out. This is the master bedroom, you know. There, and then do homework. Well, uh, this will fail if... Um, if Steffi is having twins, I really hope he's, she's not having twins. Darren came home and now still don't have my own place. What? So weird. Do we need to wait for for uh, Alexander to get home? I don't know. Or am I just blind? I think I think I'm not blind. <laughs> I'll just wait and see if, it, if the option is there when Alexander gets home. It should be any any time now. What are you fighting about? What is happening? I don't know. 
Ask to leave. <laughs> Go away. We can't have you fighting over here. Well, Alexander came home now. That's fine. And he wants to use the computer, so let's let's let him. To extract thousand simoleons and pay back entire loan and then sleep in pajamas I guess and then Darren are you allowed to move out now because I don't see a reason why he wouldn't be allowed there now the option was there does he need to bring something with him I don't think so. Like, what, what could possibly be his? Maybe one of these paintings. Um, those doesn't seem to be his. Is there another painting somewhere? Uh, the blindness strikes. <laughs> I don't know, I just felt there was one. Thank you for the follow! Never mind, I don't think he needs to bring anything with him when he moves out. And he's bringing no one as well. <laughs> How are you doing on this fine Sunday morning? I am thinking that once I do this... Oh, here comes Lucy with a... Oh, I forgot about that. <laughs> well. Once we get Darren set settled, I think we're going to end the stream because it's lunchtime. I need to make lunch. We're saving and then we're doing the thing that I always... Not always, but sometimes I do. Like so. And we do fix. Like this. Are you sure you want to do this? Yes. Because then it fixed six objects. I don't know. It makes so much sense to get Darren uh, into uh, Blue Water Village with his son Dirk because now that his wife is dead, he really needs to help his uh, his son with the economy because it's bad over there. They are uh, they were like really struggling, and I didn't know how how they would get. You know, the, the finances in order at all. And we just found out that Steph is expecting another child. <clears throat> so, um, yeah, and it's just one child because otherwise the game wouldn't have let me move Darren in. <laughs> so we know that now. Fantastic. So now uh, they don't have money. See there, it's awful. And now we need to build another room because why did I do this? We could put the bed in here. Yeah, sometimes I don't really think things through. Move objects on, but we need to like, can we afford another room for Darren? I don't know. Wait, what time is it over here? It's Saturday morning, yes. So the the ages are uh, synced, and his needs got automatically fixed. So that's fine. Do we have money to pay the loan? No. Oh yes, but then we don't have money for the bills. But maybe we, oh, poor, <laughs> poor.
Poor little Dean. <laughs> I just stole his bed and put it over here. Um, maybe I should put it the other way. Maybe we do pay back 1,100 because, and then we note in the spreadsheet, wait, wait, can we now pay bills too? Yes, Darren brought just enough money so that they can pay these bills. So the repo man will not come for a little bit. Awesome, awesome, fantastic. I don't need to note in my spreadsheet now. I was going to note that he had done a payment so that we were allowed to, to pay the bills. I do believe someone already dug in this hole, so we need to fill it in. Oh, so much things to keep track of. But now that we got somehow to Saturday morning, sort of, um, <laughs> I'm going to end the stream. Uh, let's see if someone else is playing The Sims 2 over on Twitch. Sims 2. I don't know. Yes, but last time I wasn't allowed to raid this person. Maybe they have like turned it off or something. Well, I'm, I'm still gonna try again. Start raid. We are not, we are unable to raid a tea addict at this time. So, uh, if if you want to keep watching The Sims 2, you go to to this person. <laughs> but since the the Twitch doesn't let me um, raid them, I'm going to do something else. Uh, this person is playing Sims 4. The twig vex. Yes. Okay. My beard. It's very important that we take care of my beard. So we, we raid them instead. <laughs> okay. So until next time. Where is the button? There it is. Okay. <laughs> Have a super duper time. And take care. And stay safe and everything. And don't forget to go to supervader.com and subscribe to my YouTube channel so that you can see all the previous streams uh, over there. Bye now.